Coasters. Welcome to the Mr. Coconut Show. Today's special guest, me, me, me. Oh, <laughs> Mr. Coconut, give me back my mic. Hi, listeners. He's just kidding. It's me, Luann Loud, with another Listen Out Loud podcast. Mr. C will be assisting me and providing the occasional sassy quip. Ah, I liked it better as the host. On my last podcast, I taught you about pranking. Today, you'll be listening in on a comedy workshop I'm teaching here at the Royal Woods Community Center. And get this, Benny's co-teaching with me. Her co is also her beau. Speaking of, is Benny Boy bringing the apple blossom of my eye? Of course, he never leaves home without her. Now, Mr. C, remember to control yourself. I know you get nervous and act weird when Mrs. Apple Blossom comes around. I act weird. What about you? I'm perfectly calm. You're the one. Oh, oh my gosh, there's Benny. I can't breathe. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Ow! Neither can I. Think she'll notice this dent in my head? Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. C. Ooh, is that a 94 wind star? I love the wood paneling. Oh, here he comes. How's my hair? Oh, is that your ticker making all that racket? Way to play it cool. Oh my gosh, is that my lady? How's my hair? Hey, Luann. Hi, Benny. <laughs> Put her there. <laughs> wow. Oh, I'm so sorry. I don't know why I did that. Yeah, that's okay. Oh, you, you got me. Don't worry, Luann. I'll smooth this over for us. Hey, Mrs. A. I'm pretty. You're cute. Together, we'd be pretty cute. What do you say? Oh, oh, Mr. Coconuts, you have such a way with words. See that, Luann? Saved it. Well, should we go set up? Oh, sure. Let me just get my supplies. Here, let me get that for you. Wait, Benny, watch out for my spring loaded. <laughs> Boxing glove? It's okay. Actually, it hit Mrs. Apple Blossom. Oh, I'm fine. I was a champion boxer in the marionette division. Ooh, my lady can tell jokes and throw a punch. Be still my beating heart. This place is way bigger than I thought. So many classes going on. I know. Basketball, woodworking, yowzers. I'll pass on that. Ooh. <laughs> is that Seymour's goat yoga? Wow, Seymour's really flexible. His legs are behind his head. Ooh, that didn't look good. Shake it off, Seymour. Oh, here's our classroom, Benny. Shall we set up? Oh, yes, that's perfect. Look how I set the horns up. Yep, I would put those over there, though. <laughs> I kind of like it. We're ready. Oh, the students are arriving. Wait, Lenny, what are you doing here? Well, I don't understand your jokes at home, so I thought I'd come here to learn. First question, when am I supposed to laugh? Aw, that's so supportive. But hold all the questions until the end. <laughs> Luann, you're hilarious. That wasn't a joke. See, that's why I'm here. I smell pie. Is it free? Flip, it's only for the students taking our comedy workshop. Then sign me up. When's pie time? Not yet. Take a seat. Whoa! Dead guy coming in hot! Why is there a casket in here? <gasps> this is the comedy workshop. Oh, it's just Boris. Lucy didn't mention that you were taking the workshop. I was going to take woodworking to make a bigger casket. Lately, I've been going through a growth spurt. Anyway, that class was filled up, so I am here now. Well, we're glad you're here. Really? I vote we put him back in his wooden box. Mr. Coconuts! What? We were all thinking it. Okay, everyone, let's go ahead and get started. <laughs> Oh, Luann, you crack me up. Not yet, Lenny, but I love your enthusiasm. Wait, I think I hear another student coming. <laughs> On a horse? <gasps> what happened to the lights? Ladies and gentlemen, fresh off her directing debut for Sunset Canyon's Afternoon Dinner Theater, I give you Mrs. Bernardo! And she brought her horse. Look at the size of those chompers. Oh, I'm so honored that you're taking our comedy workshop, Mrs. Bernardo. Well, since I'm already master of drama, I figured I'd try dipping my toes in the fountain of comedy. <laughs> Great. Let's get started. Today, we'll be teaching the three Ps of comedy. Prat falls, props, and puns. Uh, first up is Pratt falls. Luann's going to demonstrate. Luann, watch out for that banana peel. Huh? What banana peel? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, Luann, are you okay? Someone call an ambulance! 
sense. No, Lenny. That's what a pratfall is. I just pretend to be injured. Oh. So do you need an ice pack? Now it's your turn, class. Let's see your best pratfalls. Mrs. Bernardo, do you want to show us how it's done? It would be my pleasure. <gasps> Could the tall, sensitive man in back play me in? She must mean me. I'm walking! I'm walking! Oh, I think I'm going to fall! I have fallen! I'll never walk the stage again! Well, are the reviews in? I've got a review for you! My tiny shoe is funnier than you, toots! Oh! oh. <laughs> Mr. Coconuts, what did we talk about? What? Made my lady laugh! Listen, you little stump! Do you know who I am? The Royal Woods Gazette gave my one-woman show five stars. Was that out of 20? <gasps> no one insults Mrs. Bernardo. Oh, no, Mrs. Bernardo, please don't leave. Mr. C didn't mean it. Come on, Hamlet. Let's blow this down. <laughs> Mr. Coconut, I know you're showing off because Mrs. Apple Blossom is here, but you can't see things like that. You'll drive everyone away. Oh, I'm sorry, doll. I promise to keep my big yap shut. Why don't we move on to the next part of our comedy workshop? Good idea, Benny. Section two, props. My favorites are my squirt flower. Uh, oh. uh. Whoops. <laughs> sorry, Benny. My gag glasses, my rubber chicken, and my whoopee cushion. Who needs that? I got the real deal right here. Oh, no. Oh, good heavens. Okay, moving on. Oh, oh, uh, oh geez. Luann, can you take over? Sure. Uh, let's just turn a fan on in here. Oh, that's better. Now, if you don't have any comedy props, you can make your own. Benny and I are going to show you how with these balloons. When shaping balloons, the first thing you want to do is let out a little air like this. <laughs> This makes the balloon softer and easier to twist. And done. Look, I made a hat. And I made a duck. OK, everyone, now it's your turn. We've got balloons on the table here, so just grab a few. And listeners, that means you too. Time to start twisting. Uh, hey, Boris, what are you making? Oh, human innards. It's a special present for Mother's birthday. Yeesh. Well, that's one way to ruin a birthday. Oh, the little wooden man has hurt my feelings. I will go. No, Boris, please don't leave. Oh, Mr. C, what did they tell you about shutting your big yap? Oh, I'm sorry, toots. I'll try harder. Big yap shut. Okay, everybody, now we're going to move on to the final section of the workshop. Puns! <laughs> Luann, can you give the class an example? Certainly, Benny. Hey, guys, why did the pig sister get mad at her during dinner? Because she was hogging all the food! <laughs> <laughs> okay, now it's your turn. Let's hear your best puns. Flip, you want to start us? <laughs> Uh, never mind. Lenny, how about you start us off? Uh, uh, sometimes at night, I eat cookies and watch the dream boat. Get it? Okay, that wasn't really a pun, but interesting story. Would we call that interesting? No wonder old fart pants is snoozing. Mr. Coconut, stop being mean! Sorry to bail, Luann, but I can't take any more. See you at home. Lenny, wait! Mr. Coconut, why do you keep doing this? Uh, Luann, I think Mrs. Apple Blossom and me are gonna go. This workshop isn't going very well. I mean, Mr. Coconuts is kind of driving everyone away. Honestly, I'm scared to hear what he thinks of me. Salutations. Come on, Benjamin. No, wait, please, we're not done. Mr. Coconuts, I hope you're happy. You ruin the workshop. <laughs> hey, is it pie time? Flip! Don't touch that pie. Mr. C, come on. Let's grab Benny and Mrs. Apple Blossom before it's too late. <laughs> oh, there they are by the exit. <laughs> Benny, wait. I, I just wanted to say... <laughs> what I'm getting at is... <laughs> what is that? I'm trying to apologize here. That's the Royal Woods Werewolf Enthusiast Club. My neighbor's the pack leader. <laughs> That's him. Looks like they're done now. You were saying? I'm sorry for all the mean stuff Mr. Coconut said. We just got... I mean, I just got a little nervous. 
What do you have to be nervous about? What are you, dense kid? She likes you, you like her. I like her and I hope she likes me. Do I need to spell it out for you, Benny boy? We accept your apology and I like you too. <laughs> Oh, well, I got a splinter. Hot dog! Let's get some steaks. Hang on, we have a workshop to finish. Podcasters, we'll be back in a few. Mr. C has some apologies to make for running his chompers. Okay, we're in the classroom now and everyone's back for our last exercise. We're gonna introduce you to the fourth P of comedy, pie. Finally! We're gonna be throwing these pies at Mr. Coconuts while I roast them. Well, that's not a good idea. I'm practically firewood. No, no, no. In comedy, roasting is when you make jokes about someone. Now, normally, that's not very nice. But when it comes to roasting, everyone knows it's in good fun. And I think we can all agree Mr. Coconuts has it coming. Mrs. Apple Blossom, why don't you go first and show us how it's done? It would be my honor. Mr. Coconuts, I thought of you the other day. It reminded me to take out the trash. <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Toots. A beauty and a comedian. Here comes the pie. Mmm, rhubarb. Mrs. Bernardo is ready to do the roasting now. Mr. Coconuts, more like Mr. Bananas, because I don't understand your appeal. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a peel! Like a banana! I totally get it! Great job, Lenny! You're gonna graduate! Flip, you're up! Pass! Is there any more pumpkin? Okay, class, that's all the time we have. I hope you all had fun at our comedy workshop. Yeah, thanks for coming, everybody. And feel free to take some pie home. We got plenty of extra. I will be taking you up on that. <laughs> it was just the best thing ever. I totally want to come back. Well, podcasters, thanks so much for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed it. Hamlet, time for our departure. <laughs> Uh, uh you there. We need exit music. I got you, Mrs. B. Ah! Nice pratfall. <laughs> no, Lenny, I think she's really hurt. No, no, I'm okay. It was simply a comedic pratfall. <laughs> Lady, your horse is hagging all the lemon merengue. Hamlet, get away from the pie bar. <laughs> Come help Mommy, <laughs> won't you? I should probably go. Well, until next time, podcasters, keep laughing! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>